So yesterday, uh, we hosted family reunion at uh, our house, uh, Barrett Family Reunion, and it's been a while since the family's been able to get together. And it was great to see everybody, and typically, uh, we do a family reunion, we do a camping trip every year uh, with the extended family. And my dad listed out the last 20 years of where we went, who hosted, and just, you know, all the different family reunions. And the thing about the family reunion, right, it goes beyond those 20 years. It's uh, been generations of uh, family uh, getting together and just, even though we don't see each other that often, we don't live that close to each other, but it's that kind of that family tie that we have, right? And we recognize it and we get together and we enjoy each other's company and we catch up with one another and we have this family in this, this family blood in common with one another and uh, we get together. And even as generations come and go, that, that bind that we have remains through the generations. And I think that's the same thing we have as the family that Christ has provided for us, right? The family that we have in one another, the, that we're bound together through that sacrifice that Christ did on our behalf on the cross. And, and I think of the communion that we have every Sunday and how that goes on through the generations. Um, that we come together and we're reminded of what was done for us and what unites us, even though we have different backgrounds and we have different daily lives, but we're united in what's been done for us. We're united in the, uh, the blood that Christ uh, shed for us. And we're united on where we get to go, where our home is, and our destination of heaven because of what's done for us. We're bound together through Christ. Let's go uh, to God in prayer and just thankfulness for that, that bind that we have through Christ. Heavenly Father, we approach you this morning just looking back on the cross and are just so thankful for Christ's sacrifice on our behalf. And we're thankful that we are a, a family brought together through that sacrifice, a family that uh, is, has the, the common just tie of the same future, the same confidence in, in a reward to come because of what was done for us, presented clean before you by Christ's blood and uh, sacrifice on the cross. Lord, we'd ask that you uh, bless this bread that we're about to partake of that uh, just symbolizes uh, Christ's body on the cross. It's in his name that we pray. Amen. Let's continue our prayer. Lord, we're so grateful that uh, we have a confidence of our future because you love us so much that you provided your son for us and that he was willing to be that sacrifice for us and that help us understand it's not because of something we're doing, but it's all because of what Christ has done that gives us the opportunity to spend an eternity with you. Lord, uh, please bless this fruit of the vine, which is that uh, representation of that blood that was shed on our behalf. In Christ's name, amen.
And just like a, a family reunion where I get to catch up with family members they haven't seen in a while and learn about what has been going on in their life, um, it's always good just to take that stock and awareness of what's going around, what's going on around you. Um, just talking with others, that taking stock. And I always think that's what I, I like about an opportunity to give back on, on Sundays and just that awareness. And you go, man, we've just been blessed in so many ways. Amen. We all have a, a story of what's going on in our lives. And when we can just slow down enough and uh, learn other people's story and think about your own story and just recognize how active God is in our life. And an opportunity to give back in that recognition and say thank you God for blessing me and in that awareness and want to give back uh, financially with our time and just being good stewards of everything God's blessed us with. Let's go to God now and just a thankfulness for how he loves us so much and is, uh, has given us so much. Please bow with me. Heavenly Father, thank you for being active in our lives. Thank you for blessing us in so many ways that we can't even count. And uh, Lord, help open up our eyes and, and, and to see how you're present with us always. And even in the struggles, uh, you're there. Um, and, and you're just blessing us beyond beyond measure. And we just pray that this this offering this morning is uh, just ask for you to, to bless it to further your work in so many ways and that uh, that we can give back to that effort just with a with a cheerful heart in a recognition of what you've done for us thank you for loving us and being with us always it's in your son's name that we pray amen